and the new government has not considered even the promise that given to the people of Embu to be sorted out. And therefore, we are giving a rallying call. The institution has come that the doctor of Embu are saying that they're tired to be in the hospitals when they are not supported. They're tired to be in the hospitals when their employment terms are not guaranteed. They're put on arbitrary contracts that they do not know the times are going to expire. They're being put on arbitrary contracts that cannot make them to have career progression. Embu County, despite the national government having released or remitted all the money to the counties, have not paid total remittances for over five months and to some over six months. So we have doctors here, consultants, and all of them that are not able to access funds in, the, in their accounts. And this is because their statutory deductions, their, their loans, which were deducted by this particular county, have not been remitted. Today we have sat, and we think that the county is not looking at a positive way to sort out these issues. We are here today to give a notice. It's not a threat, it's a notice, and we will actualize it on 28th of this month that if the county has not taken keen the issues of doctors in Embu County, then on 28th midnight, there'll be no doctor that will be working in these particular hospitals. We are demanding that these doctors be supplied with equipment, with the drugs, with all those things that will make sure that they offer their services efficiently. We are demanding that the consultants, that the doctors who are working in different job groups, be promoted as per the schemes of service, and as per the CBAs, these documents that were negotiated and signed, they're not meant to gather dust in the closets of different county governments or county officials. They're done so that they can benefit workers in this particular county. And therefore, we're demanding that the governor, the county government, should consider the plight of the Embu residents by ensuring that the doctors are motivated. We are also saying the shortage in this county is enormous. The, the population has continuously increased, but there has not been employment of doctors and other healthcare workers. So we are also demanding that doctors be employed in the county of Embu so that the resident can get services. These are the demands that we are putting forth to the county government of Embu in the notice that we are going to put. Because we have, in the previous times, given a notice for disputes, we have tried to have a discussion with the county and there has not been, we have not seen any results up to now. Today we have met with the consultants and doctors in Embu County to agitate for the poor working conditions that have been witnessed in Embu County for the last 10 years. We expected there is, that uh, there will be a change with the change of uh, governor in Embu County, but we are sending a very stern warning to Madam Cicely Barrier because uh, doctors in Embu County have not been promoted for the last 10 years. We are aware that she, had, uh, she has taken the mantle of leadership uh, just for the last uh, eight months, but we want to send a warning because even with, within these particular eight months, there is no step that has been taken by the county government of Embu towards solving the crisis uh, of shortage of doctors in Embu County promoting doctors in Embu County, payment of statutory deductions. Essentially, it is illegal for somebody, uh, you know, to deduct your money and not submit it in your bank. Some of the people, some of our colleagues here in Embu County are losing their properties to the bank. Some of the, our colleagues are losing whatever they have been earning, whatever they have invested for the last 10 years to the banks due to non-payment of statutory deductions. So we are telling the governor if this issue is not sorted out, in the next 21 days, there shall be a massive strike of healthcare workers, not just doctors, in Embu County. We are sending a warning that any resident in the next 21 days should seek services in Kirinyaga County and the Rakanithi County and Meru County for the services of healthcare, uh, whatever health is supposed to provide in Embu County since Embu County has been a, an hostile employer.